this is just to show you my mounting application as you can see I filed that screw down it was a lot longer I couldn't find one one and three quarter inches but that would be ideal at one and three quarter inch so this is the bolt size which is eight you know, metric eight point uh, one two five and if you look on this side and on this side of the bracket housing right here here's your bracket housing you, you got a housing on this side you got another one on this side it's a standard uh, transit mount so the thing is um, this bracket that comes with this uh, ram unit this is the, the pole ram unit okay so that's that basic adjustable rod you know the aluminum rod ram unit so I was like I got it and it had that single thing coming up the middle single mount for offset that's for smaller transducers now I got the uh, the G52 and that comes with the echo um, the echo map I bought the Echo Map I bought the Echo Map 73 chirp unit, you know, and it came with that 52. And that had didn't have any, you know, the smaller transducers right in the center of the housing. Instead of it being a bracket on this side and this side, the bracket is just in the middle, you know, and that would have clamped to this to this. So I was like, what am I going to do? So I went to the parts store and I got a couple of bushings and I mounted it I squeezed it with some washers between the two bushings I got a bolt to go all the way through versus one over here and one over here which would tighten down on either side of that metal for the transom so it works great it's tight I could pick it up you know does a good job now, I haven't tried it on the water. There is just a little flexibility because of the rubber, but, you know, you can go to a different material, different type of grommet or different kind of bushing, maybe, and pinch it in there uh, with something other than rubber. So we're going to try it this way. Looks okay. It looks great. So hopefully this will answer a lot of your guys' questions because I know there's probably a lot of guys that bought this Echo Map and then they pick this up for their small boat, maybe their canoe or kayak. And they're like, well, what do I do now? So hopefully this helps you out. Thanks for watching. What's happening, everybody? <laughs> out here with Mark, man. We're having a ball, just relaxing, enjoying the sunshine. We had three fish knock on the rods, but, you know, they didn't stay on there, unfortunately. What, nice what is this, July, or what? what's the month you have here? Well, it feels like August. But, uh, <laughs> and here we are in, in the beginning of March. March? March 10th, or 9th, 10th. Might be the 9th. The 9th or the 10th. Yeah. I mean, when you're a fishing bum, you don't look at the calendar. <laughs> <laughs>